I do want to ask you uh, what your thoughts are on Errol Spence Jr. Uh, activating his rematch clause. In this particular situation, I really have no interest in the rematch. I, I don't, the, the first fight d decided it for me. I don't have no cares in the world for the rematch. I don't want to see it. I just don't see anything different. I mean, I, it, it was very clear that Terrence can hurt Errol. Uh, that was what I was more banking on, the fact that Errol fights at a pace and an and ex-lightweight like Ter Terrence wouldn't be able to hurt Errol and, and stop that pace. I was wrong. Um, Terrence can clearly hurt Errol, and so uh, Errol, uh, r for me, I didn't see any even an attempt at an adjustment. Errol has to come forward to, to beat you and mow you down. If he starts going backwards, he's out of ideas. He can't fight going backwards. I don't know what he's going to do in terms of being more deceptive and coming forward that, that, he didn't, that he didn't show us the first time. But that is, he hasn't showed us his whole career. I mean, Terrence is very, very deceptive, and, I, and he can hurt you, obviously. Now we've seen it. So I, I just don't see anything else happening besides the same result.